you have an iPhone SE 2, the 2020 version, and you have an issue where you have a black screen of death. So whatever you do, you cannot turn it on, but you know that your phone is on. Maybe you can feel it vibrate or see a LED notification or you can hear it ring. You just can't get the screen on, okay? So very, very simple here, okay? I'm going to give you guys several solutions, and most of you guys, at least 90% of you guys are going to be up and running by the end of this video, okay? First thing is take note. Let's just pretend this phone is not is actually fixed, but let's just pretend it has a black screen of death. Okay, so step number one is this. We're gonna force it to reboot. How do you do that? Pretend my screen is perfectly black here and I want you to do uh, a three key combination. I want you to press the volume up, volume down, and then press and hold the power button until we see the Apple logo and then let go. So let's try this together, ready? Volume up, volume down, power button, press and hold. Do not let go of that power button. Let's pretend the screen is totally black. We don't know what's going on. I'm still holding on to that power button or side button. I'm just waiting, hoping I get like an Apple logo that appears. If it does, I'm gonna go ahead and let go and hopefully I'm back up and running. Okay, Apple logo, now I can go ahead and let go of the power button. And now hopefully you guys are up and running. Now, if you guys are still down, then the next thing I want you to do is this. Go ahead and get your lightning cable. And what I want you to do is I want you to plug your phone in and I want, and I want you to let it charge, okay? So pretend it's a black screen, let it charge for five minutes. After five minutes is up, I want you to come back to it and let's do the same thing. Let's let's force it to reboot. Okay, again, pretend my screen is black. Let's force it to reboot. Remember, volume up, volume down. Press and hold the power button. Do not let go of the power button. Again, let's pretend the screen is totally black. I'm still holding on to this power button. I'm not going to let go until I see that Apple logo. I'm still holding on to the power button. And it's all charging, too, at the same time. Okay, Apple logo, go ahead and let go. And hopefully, you guys are up and running. Now, if you guys are still down, if it's still a black screen, then we're going to go to the next step. Okay, so for the next step, again, make sure that your lightning cable is plugged in so and, and let it charge for a little bit, okay? Next thing we're going to do now is we're going to do this, okay? Because there's a possibility sometimes if your uh, power button is like loose, jam, or stuck, it'll keep the screen on a black screen as well and do all, all kinds of other things as well. Anyways, keep it plugged in. And now what you want to do is go ahead and press the power button. Pretend my phone is black here. Press it in and out. Let's try to get it like loosened up. Maybe it's stuck. Let's unjam it and just kind of press it kind of hard, okay? Do it like 30, 40 times. Keep on doing that. There, okay? It's still plugged in. Now do the same thing again, okay? Let's let's force it to reboot. Volume up, volume down. Press and hold that power button. Do not let go until we see that Apple logo. Again, let's pretend the screen is black. I'm still holding on to the power button. Still holding on, waiting for an Apple logo to appear. Still waiting. There we go. We can go ahead and let go of the power button, and hopefully you guys are up and running. Now, if you guys are still down, this is what I want you to do. Okay, go ahead and unplug your um, your iPhone SE, and this is what I want you to do next. What I want you to do is I want you to massage the iPhone SE. Okay, I mean you can use two thumbs like this, and what I want you to do is basically press on the screen kind of hard. Okay press all over. Uh, you can always get like a napkin or something like that if you don't want to get it all dirty or, or fingerprints on it. So basically this is what I want you to do, okay? So we're going to do the the, the front, front of the screen and also the back of the phone, okay? So use both thumbs and what I want you to do is press kind of in like this. Sometimes it's like a minor loose connection. You know, a lot of times you get the black screen when you drop the phone too. And actually if you drop it again, usually it comes back on and you never have an issue again. Anyways, keep doing this. Keep giving like a nice massage all the way, all over. Flip it over and do it on the back side as well. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and gotta be a little bit like, a little tough on here. All over, just keep giving a massage. Okay, and then flip it back over and do the same thing. Okay, we're gonna force it to reboot. Volume up, volume down. Press and hold the power button. Do not let go until we see the Apple logo. Okay, I'm still holding on to the power button here. Waiting for the Apple logo to appear. Still holding on. Where's it at? There it is. Let go. And hopefully you guys are up in business. Now, if you're still down, the next thing I want you to do is this. Okay, very similar to the massage, except this time what we're going to do is we're going to do what I call the tap method. Go ahead, and you can use one finger or two fingers. What I want you to do is tap all over in front of the screen, okay? Oops. In front of the screen, just tap. Kind of hard, okay? You can use two fingers too all over all over same thing on the back side okay even around the camera lens 
you want to go ahead and bang all around there too. Tap all around there and just keep on going, okay? Keep on tapping for a while all over. Then turn it over and do the force uh, reboot again. Remember, volume up, volume down, press and hold the power button, okay? Try that. If it's still not working, the next thing I want you to do is this. Now this method here, I call it the smack method. Why? Because you're going to smack it. What we're going to do is we're going to hold out our palm of our hands like this, and we're going to smack the screen all over and also the backside, okay? We'll start on the backside here, okay? We'll go ahead and give it up. All over the top, you also want to go on the bottom as well. And then also on the screen. Turn it over, get the bottom of the screen as well. Just like that. Now. Same thing, what you want to do is go ahead and force it to restart. Remember, volume up, volume down, press and hold the power button. Now the thing is, guys, if you still have a black screen of death here, what I want you to do is I want you to do every single step in here and do it five, six, maybe even seven times, okay? And you know, a lot of times, third time is a charm. You know, Once you get it back up from a black screen, and if you're lucky, it never ever, for years and years again, it never happens again. Anyways, remember, at least try it six or seven more times you still have a black screen. Like I said, most of you guys, by the end of this video, you guys are going to be up and running. If you are, thumbs up. Let me know which step worked for you. If it didn't work for you, give me a thumbs down so others can see as well. Good luck.